Hi, I'm AJ, and I'm jonesing with... Man! And tonight, we're jonesing on Sugar School, Madagascar, Wild Berry. <laughs> Um, and joining me on Jones and with Man this evening. Good to uh, be here. Got a special treat. Uh, other than just having you here, of course. Huh? Of course. <laughs> this is uh, one of Masterpiece, make him say, Ooh, mm. one of the five flavors of rum that he's released under the Sugar School rum category. Didn't even know he had a rum. Yeah, I think that's the problem. See, Master P, we're trying to uh, get you some promotion and get you out well. there. And, you know, <laughs> cut the check. Cut the check. Oh, at least they're free bottles. At least they're free bottles. Uh, I actually got this today. Uh, I had been looking. We tried the coconut and we tried the tribal silver. I'm trying to, it might be Madagascar coconut too, but that and the tribal silver in a couple of different episodes. So make okay. sure you check those out. Uh, and I hunted and I hunted and I could not find the wild berry, the cinnamon, mm. and then there is a vanilla. There's a website called Remedy Liquors. Okay. Shout out Remedy Liquors. Hey, we're always looking to send us something. Uh, and they had them. Okay. I was able to order them. They came in today and you were like, hey, well, let's get together. Let's think about shooting something. And I was like, I got the perfect thing. Nice. Glad I can try it. Oh, yeah. Mr. P, I'm about to see if it's worth it. Okay, okay. Make them say, uh. Oh. All right, um, so what we'll do is around here we have house rules. Okay. Uh, we pour a couple straight shots. Okay. We pour a couple shots on the rocks. We really just taste it, kind of talk about what we like, what we don't like. I normally give a little bit more background on the liquor, but that's pretty much all you need because you've seen it in the two previous episodes. Okay. Uh, we'll spend a little time getting to know you, so maybe while we're pouring and talking, uh, I happen to know that you have some special things going on. Maybe we can get a collab going on. Uh, and then we'll uh, we'll talk a little bit more about that. Maybe get you to share a tipsy tale. Sound good? Sound good. All right, cool. So I'm going to do what I do, which is crack the bottle. I happen to know that these are cork. So that's pretty cool. Nice. Let me get this. Hold on. One of my audience's favorite, favorite sounds. Like that sound. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> So we'll pour two, and because I know that we're going to do a little extra drinking tonight, we'll do a half shot. Okay. Half, half shot. Work, half works. That's how I believe the saying is, clink them and drink them, right? You, oh, look at that. Uh, First, let's take a little, little. And we kind of talked about. It delicious. Yeah, it's, a, it's got a little vanilla, but I do get a, a berry scent. Mm-hmm. And I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm a fan of wild berry. But I am very intrigued about this. No yes. alcohol scent? Yeah, none at all. None at all? I, yeah, I can smell the coconut and the berry. Yeah, all right. Well, let's, let's do what we do. Click them and drink them. Mm. Oh. Make them say, oh. oh. yeah. All right, well, let's, let's put this on the rocks. Uh, what did you think first taste? It's not, you know how some shots, like, who hit you in the chest? Yeah. Well, the throat first, and then yeah. the chest. That was really Eyes smooth. Eyes and nose sometimes. Like, yeah. But that was really smooth. Like I'm, I'm actually impressed by that. Okay. Like it doesn't feel like a shot. Yeah. Uh, I get a little burn on the back end, um, just just lightly, not really hot, but you know, you feel like ooh, it's a little, little bit. It was alcohol. Right. It was. Yeah, they have a little something, yeah. but not like. Not major. Not major at all. Um, this bottle was 21, 22 bucks. Um, it's 30% volume, alcohol by volume, so it's, a, what's that, 60 proof? Uh, and this is a fifth. Uh, I had to pay a little bit to have them shipped, but since I had like five shipped, uh, you know, it wasn't too, it wasn't too right. bad. It's kind of worth it when you're shipping multiple. Yeah, yeah. For, uh, I think the other ones I got in Florida were like 24, 25. Well, so about the same when you think about by it. By the time yeah. I divide my shipping, I'm... Paid just about pretty much yeah. the same. So not too bad. Um, we normally do the, the second shot on the rocks okay. because the water sometimes will kind of open up the flavor of the alcohol. Okay. Sometimes it's the same thing, just cold. Sometimes you get a completely different flavor. I'm really feeling the snowball, by the way. Like snowball? <laughs> normally this is whiskey, but hey, we'll go for it. We'll okay. go for it. Um, it's got the same kind of scent. Same scent, Same yeah. kind of scent. So click them and drink them. Mm. 
Mm. The ice does give it a different um, yeah. chill factor. It does get a little chill factor. Flavor gets a little, uh, I think it gets a little stronger on the rice. That's going to say it's a lot more robust. The berry is. Yeah, for sure. The other part that we do here is after we taste, mm. we talk about whether or not it's a favorite, meaning that we like it, we probably buy it again, or it's a flop. And then we kind of add some commentary to why we think it's a favorite, why we think it's a flop, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. Um, so, what do you think? Favorite or flop? I would say favorite. Favorite? Like, I'm, like I said, I didn't even know he had a brand of rum, um, but I absolutely would buy that again if given the opportunity. So, now that I know where I can get it, since I can't just go into right, the store, right, right, right. I'll, I'll place an order for that, absolutely. Remedyliquors.com? Um, I actually, I like it. Uh, I've had, and I, I think you had a little taste of the coconut. Yes. Um, the coconut is definitely my preference. There's a, just a tad bit of kind of aftertaste with the wild berry. Now, I don't know if that's because I don't know what wild berry really tastes like and I don't really like wild berry. Um, it's not bad at all. Uh, I think it would complement a mixed drink extremely well. Absolutely. Extremely well. Absolutely. Um, so I would definitely say it's a favorite. It's a favorite for me. I, I probably, if given the choice, coconut, wild berry, I would go coconut over the wild berry. Mm, see, I would go wild berry over the coconut. Okay. So, yeah, and you're probably, you probably like strawberries and things of that sort. So that's that little tartness. I think that's tartness. Maybe that's what that is. Yeah. A little tartness. Vaguely. Yeah. Um, it's, I think for me, I feel like I'm having a mixed drink. Without the mix. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I know uh, all the ladies are always worried about calories and being fit and things of that sort. So drinking this without any extra mixers and everything yeah. definitely is going to cut back on your Takes calories. the sugar out, takes the yeah. calories yeah. out. Yeah. yeah. I would do that hands down, but okay. just on the rocks. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. I, I, like, I like it. I like it. So definitely. So that is two, two favorites. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Master P. Uh, I'm super excited. <laughs> I'm even excited about trying the cinnamon. You know, when you said cinnamon, when you were going through the names, I thought, mm -hmm. huh. I should have said cinnamon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I kind of, I think it feel, I feel like it's going to be like fireball or something maybe. And I think that's what I was thinking when yeah. you said cinnamon. My mind went to, oh, is it going to be more like fireball cinnamon? Or more like a uh, hot ball. Right, uh, like the called? candy back in the day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, Atomic yeah. fireball. Atomic, no, that's what I'm saying. I like hot ball, but maybe <laughs> that's, that's something else. It was hot. You couldn't yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. okay, okay, okay. The new ones you can. Yeah, they don't, the, the kids today don't have it like we had it. We had to like put it in, take it out, hold it, breathe a little bit. Well, the inside of your in. jaw will get raw right over there on the side. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely, definitely. That's not how it is now. You can just eat those things like, <laughs> right. <laughs> All right. So while we're sitting here sipping on this wild berry Madagascar that happens to be a favorite, mm -hmm. I happen to know that uh, you've got some social media, of course, that you want to share. I do. And you want to talk a little bit about what it is that you do on your channel. Sure. So my channel is Accessories Junkie, um, and that's also my tag on Instagram. I like to talk about all things accessories. I'm obsessed, i.e. Accessories Junkie. Um, and hopefully we'll look forward to doing a collab with you. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I think that we'll sip on this a little bit more. Sure. Uh, we'll kind of take a little break here. Um, I'll give the closing credits and all that good jazz. All right. And then maybe we'll do an episode uh, for your channel. So, everybody, I'll put the link down. I'll put her social media, AJ's social media, everything down below, the link to her channel. Uh, you can follow over and check it out and see what Jones and Man does on... Accessory Junkies channel. Yeah. All right. So, uh, you can be sure to subscribe. I always forget that. Be sure to subscribe. Uh, you can Don't follow. Forget Don't forget that. <laughs> Click the bell so you get notifications. You can follow us on Facebook, on Twitter, on um, Instagram under at jonesandman.com and this has been another episode of Jones and Man's clink them and drink them and we'll see you next time we'll see you over on Accessories Junkie